What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be giving you a short update on what's happening with my Mark VI Fiesta. So guys, um, in short, basically my uh, Mark VI Fiesta, so basically a faster daily, um, basically a few weeks back, the starter motor packed up. Um, weirdly enough, while I was in a petrol station, it was really annoying, I just put some fuel in it. Um, basically, we got it back home, um, and if you own one of these, you'll know that the starter motor is insanely difficult to do on this car. Um, I've had a go myself, and yeah, it is. And the problem with like reading the Haynes manual, it doesn't take into account that this car has air conditioning and power steering and ABS, which the Haynes manual one doesn't have. So you've got all that in the way. Um, I think one of the bolts is also rounded, which is why I can't get it off. In general, you can't see or reach what you're doing down there, which is really, really frustrating. Um, that basically happens on a lot of cars. Um, so as it stands, it's literally just sitting here now, um, awaiting repair. Um, there are some other things I've discovered, you know, while it's been sat. It's got a monumental coolant leak around the back of the engine. Um, the power steering rack is actually leaking, which is, I think, why my steering was so notchy. Um just some nitty gritty little things that need actually sorting out so basically for the time being it's just gonna be sat there in today's video i'm gonna be trying to take the front bumper off and the, the whole front assembly just so i can see if i can get better access to things in there because it's really difficult to get any tools in there so yeah basically that's what's happened with my mark 6 fiesta um hopefully i'll be able to fix it soon because it is my daily um thankfully my mum's letting me use her car um but yeah so um just in this video, we're taking the front bumper off um, and we'll just see how that goes and see if I can get some better access to what I need to work on. First step, jack up the car and secure it on an axle stand. Then use a 19mm to remove the front wheel nuts and then put both front wheels underneath the car for an extra layer of safety. Then use a Torx bit to remove the small plastic screws to hold the wheel arch liner in. I don't know the official size of these as mine have been changed previously, but all good tool kits should have a few different sizes of them. Once these are removed, Pull back the front part of the arch liner to reveal three 10mm bolts on each side. Undo these and the front bumper should begin to hang on the front. If like me, make sure to remove the fog lamp wires. Then undo the plastic clips on the front top and simply pull the bumper upwards and out to remove it. So there we go guys, that's the end of the video pretty much. Um, so yeah, that's basically what's happening with uh, my Mark VI Fiesta. Um, this is also how you get the front bumper off of Mark VI Fiesta. Hopefully look out soon because I've been wanting to take the entire front off, so the top part there and then the radiator shroud and the crash bar and all that all that gubbins there to see if I can get this absolute annoying start motor, which has really pissed me off. Um, well, apart from that, guys, that's it. Uh, that's happening. If you've got a Mark VI Fiesta project car of your own, let me know. Um, but apart from that, don't forget to like and subscribe if you like the video, and I will see you in my next video.